Get down here! Cyclops got a message for you. <clears throat> Tell your boss he can stick it. That's for last week! Pfft, Malaka! The Cyclops said you like to act tough, so act tough! Get a little closer and I will. You should know by now. The Cyclops always collects his debts. You have a lesson to learn. If the Cyclops wants to teach me, tell him to come here himself. Never mess with the Cyclops! Last week? <laughs> this shit happens every week. <sighs> I can't keep doing this. <whistles> nah. Thanks for the warning. Ah. <sighs> What happened to you? It's nothing, Phoebe. All taken care of now. The Cyclops again, huh? Hasn't he learned his lesson yet? Apparently not. Of course. Help yourself. You hungry too, Icarus? <laughs> Do you think Zeus will bless me with an ego like he blessed you, Alexios? Maybe you could ask him for me. I'll try to put in a good word for you. Finally. So, what are you doing here? Oh, I almost forgot. Marcos is looking for you. <sighs> what does that weasel want now? Don't know. He wants you to meet him at his new house. On his vineyard. Wait. What? A vineyard? Malaka! It's on the road to Sami. He says wine will make him rich. Since when has he had a vineyard? Yesterday, I think. So, Marcos, who owes me drag me, is buying vineyards. With what money? I don't know. Where can I find Marcus's new beautiful estate? You know the statue of Zeus on Mount Ainos? It's south of that. Well, I guess I owe Marcus a little visit. Thank you, Phoebe. <coughs> I'll go tell Marcos you're coming.
Fun's over. Tell that one-eyed freak, if he sends you here again, I'm going to cut his other eye out and feed it to my bird. I'll see Marcos as soon as I'm dressed. I have to go up top to get dressed. Let's get this on. There you are. Let's see what you've gotten yourself into this time, Marcos. By the gods, what's happened here? Oh, oh. 
Boss, I, I keep telling you, you, you can't do that. Why? It's my farm. I can plant what I want. The grapes will die here. All of them. You have to forget what you know about the past, my friend. Together, we will revolutionize winemaking. Believe me, you will look back on this day and... Alexios, thank the gods! Phoebe found you, you in time. About grapes. I can still hear you! I was worried sick. The Cyclops sent his scum to find you. I think they mean you harm. I wish you would have told me that before they hit me. But that's besides the point. You bought a vineyard, Marcos? A vineyard? Why not? I like wine, you like wine, everybody likes wine. Everybody buys wine. Why not from me? Because you don't know how to grow grapes or make wine. I'm a fast learner. You grow grapes on the vine, then you get some wine. Oh, it's that simple, is it? You know me better than to think I don't have a plan. Marcos always has a plan. All right. Then do you have the money you owe me? Do I have the money I owe you? Of course, of course. Well, no, not at the moment. Then get it. Instantly, my friend, instantly. But uh, maybe you should do that. There is a merchant in Sammy. I'm not very good at these things, as you know. You want me to collect my own debt? It's just waiting for you and Sammy, my friend. Who's the merchant? Luris. You know Luris. He's very nice. Luris? How stupid can you get? Stop giving him money. He always pays me back. After I threaten him? Exactly. Everybody benefits. Luris gets his money, I get my interest, and you have work. Kefalonia is wonderful, is it not? How do you want to handle this one? Not like you handled that olive oil business. That was... Uh, that was too much. <laughs> I got the money. And now we'll never get any more from him. If you kill them all, nobody benefits. Threatening them and maybe more. Breaking things, certainly. Steal the money if you have to, but don't rob me of my customers. Unless you can't avoid it. These things happen. Where can I find Luis? In a shop in Sami, overlooking the docks. You know this, Alexios. Will he be there? You mistake me for the Pythia. I couldn't possibly know. He'd better have my money, Marcos. I'd hate to have to sell our vineyard. Of course he will. Oh, after, there's another matter I want to discuss with you. After. Fine, but I'm taking a horse. It's too hot and too long a walk to go on foot. But... Think of it as interest, Marcos. Everybody benefits. Of course, my friend. You shall have your pick. One in the middle. Tell me about it. Ah, you have picked a beauty, my friend. That horse is from the Salonia, bred for its courage. Tell me about this one. The Skiros. You have an eye for sturdy stock, my friend. That horse can cling to mountain passes like a goat. Huh. I like the look of the one on the right. Ah, the Macedonia. These are bred for battle. A true warrior's horse. I've made my choice. Which one will it be? I'll take the one in the middle. Ah, uh, a, a fine choice. But this particular breed has a few quirks that you might not be aware of. I wouldn't want you to take an unworthy horse. This is the one I want. Are you sure? Because... I'm sure, Marcos. Everybody benefits, especially you. You've chosen the great Phobos. He's never let me down. Phobos. Remember, meet me at the temple in Sami when you have uh, your money from Duris. Ah, Efterpi. There's plenty of wine left to buy. Don't fret.
Not now, you fool. Phoebe's been taken. By who? Thugs of the Cyclops. Who else? Snatched her right off the main road. Tell me where they went. In the direction of Itimena Beach. The beach? Can she swim? I'll get her. Yes, go. But don't forget about Dirduris, Alexios. <laughs>